Hey guys, how's it going? Today I want to do just kind of a quick review for you guys on the Smart Bidet SB1000 Electric Bidet Seat. Um, hadn't seen too many reviews on this bidet, uh, so I thought I'd kind of give you guys my two cents uh, based on my experience and let you know what I thought about it. Um, I should mention too, real quick, that I actually found a pretty good deal on this bidet, and I'll put a link in the description below so you guys can check that deal out if you're interested in picking one up for yourself. Okay, so I should preface this review very quickly that I've always been a big Toto bidet fan. Um, up until this point, they have made the best bidets for the money out there. But honestly, um, this is the new king for value. Uh, I was blown away at the quality of this thing for the price. This is easily on par, if not supersedes, Toto's bidets for literally half the price. And in my opinion, the SB1000 is the perfect sweet spot because they do make higher end models. They do make a little some lower end models. But for the money, this is the perfect sweet spot where like if you pay more, you're not getting much more. But this is just the perfect in terms of price value ratio, I guess you could say. Okay, so let's talk about why. One First thing, quality. Exceptionally well made, very, very solid. Um, all the parts, ceramic heaters, stainless steel parts all over the place, extremely good quality. Two, the way it cleans. Um, without getting into too much detail, it works exceptionally well. It has one of the best cleaning systems that I've ever used, that I've ever tested uh, by far. It has five different levels of adjustable pressure, it has three different levels for temperature, and it has five different nozzle positions that can all be custom made and custom stored into the unit. It does have an air dryer feature which is adjustable up to five levels of pressure too and it works really really good. It honestly, it sounds really weird and if you've never had a bidet before you'll really think this is weird but you, you really, it eliminates the need for toilet paper completely. Um, it it cleans far better. I mean, if, if you've never had a bidet before, welcome to the best thing you've probably ever bought in your life. Honestly, it sounds weird, but it's one of those things that's like I could never not have one of these things for the rest of my life. Let me put it this way. Like, if you were outside and a bird happened to lay a dropping on your shoulder or your arm... Are you going to just wipe that off with a towel and say, or, a, or, a, or a piece of paper or a Kleenex and say, well, yeah, that's good? Or are you going to wash it off with water? I mean, let's, let's face it here. You know what I mean? Anyway, back to the SB1000. Extremely comfortable seat. Um, you're getting basically all the features you need with nothing you don't. It, it doesn't have an auto-closing lid. Who really cares? It does have a soft closing lid, which is worth noting too. This one does have the little soft close so it'll never slam or anything like that. It's very easy to install, which is also uh, a nice thing. Comes with all the required fittings to install it. Uh, it'll hook up to any standard toilet. They do make an elongated and a round version depending on what kind of toilet you have. Um, the remote control is very intuitive, very simple, very basic. It just works. You have like probably about 10 buttons on there. It's just very easy, well laid out, simple to use, basic, but very, very functional. The nozzle is self-cleaning and retractable. The self-cleaning is of utmost importance and it's really nice to have a self-cleaning nozzle. But yeah, in terms of value, you will not find another bidet out there that has heated water, warm air dryer, heated seat, extremely well quality made, and a really, really good cleaning system for this money. Or this amount of money, rather. Anyway, highly, highly recommended. I absolutely love it. Um, anyway, if you guys have any more questions on it, just leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.